Hello, it's Adrian. I can't talk very loudly because Amos is asleep. And he went to sleep about 6.40, which is real early, but um, you can only potty train for so long. And that's clearly been weighing heavily in my mind. So now I'm in the bathroom. I'm in this robe because I didn't feel like putting on a bra. And I've just gotten this $50 dinner from downstairs in the restaurant. Um, one of those meals where you, you say we would like because you're embarrassed that it's just one person. But I got a salad, fried green tomatoes, and macaroni and cheese. And I figured it could be breakfast too. Um, so anyway, I, um, let's see. Tomorrow we leave, but I have a few things weighing heavily in my mind, and I really don't feel like writing about them because I don't want anything in print that long. But I'm feeling a little bit bitter. Now, the reason I'm bitter is that um, people that are passive aggressive really piss me off, basically, because I invented passive aggressive. So I can't stand when somebody uses my own trick on me. Um, and I love to find kindness and wonderful things, and I'd like to be known for that. But truthfully, I get, I'm sort of passive aggressive. So anyway, I've had a couple of things happen that I just would like to point out so I can go ahead and release them. Oh my gosh, there's so much food in here on the floor. Um, anyway, I don't blame the nice cleaning lady for hiding from our room today. There's some pizza. Oh, anyway, so I've had two things happen. I didn't even know that could happen. Anyway, I'll talk to him in a little while. Um, okay, one was my nice, very nice driver, Chris, has been taking Amos and I all around all week. Um, and today we had to drop off a few people at the CDC. This is the Center for Disease Control. It's a really important place um, and interesting. Well, they have a security guard there. <clears throat> now, there's nothing I hate more than security that's like silly security. So the security guard wants everybody's driver's license in the car. Well, of course I don't have my driver's license. I have like a hotel key and some wet wipes and a bottle of Coke. But anyway, I said, I don't have my license. So then she starts asking Amos questions, which that makes for interesting things because he basically acts like he doesn't hear you because he has autism and doesn't pay attention. So anyway, she says to him, how old are you? And he says, how old are you? And she says, no, I asked you, <laughs> how old are you? And he said, how old are you? And she said, are you going to repeat everything I say? And I said, um, yes, he will. He has echolalia. He has autism. That's sort of what they do. And she was like, oh God, just go ahead and go through it. So anyway, so see, it's important to be passive aggressive smart ass when you're trying to discourage people, um, from being, a pain in the ass, basically. The second thing happened was Amos and I have been running down the hall for exercise between pottying, and he really is doing much better. Um, I mean, he's still peeing my bed tonight, but he's doing better, and we have a whole another week to go, so Lord help us. But anyway, so tonight we did laundry, because you know we have a lot, and I've been doing it in the sink, and then I discovered a washing machine. Um, so we went down there and we did laundry. Well, we were on the potty, so we couldn't go back to get it. So when we went back to get it, wait, this is really good. We went back to get it. It was probably 30 minutes overdue. Well, a woman had put all the wet stuff on top of the dryer, which is fine. No offense taken. And she says, I don't want to wake him up. She says, my stuff is just finished. And I said, oh, yeah, you know, well, it took me a little while. And she goes, well, do you mind if I go ahead and use the dryer? And I said, well, um, I guess, is it, is it important to you? And she said, yeah, I'd kind of like to just go ahead and finish my laundry. And I said, well, that's okay. You know, it's just his underwear and pajamas, but I can keep him up. She goes, are you sure you don't mind? I mean, what the... And her husband was like, no, she needs to go ahead and do it. I said, well, no, it's no problem. Um, you know, I just pulled out the, like, he has special needs card and we have no laundry, which was a lie. But I mean, can people get some sense? Like her stuff had just finished. 
But anyway, those are my two main problems. Um, and now I don't have them anymore. Mm, mm. The last thing is bartenders that think they're funny. You know, I know I think I'm funny, but I can't stand a bartender that thinks he's funny. And so when I say like, can I have some ice? And then he says, I don't think so. That's too much to ask. Like at this point in the week, it, I'm not laughing. Um, but anyway, we're heading home tomorrow. We have a week of potty training left, like through next Thursday. Um, I'll be in Salter Path, Pineal Shores. If anybody wants to come by and visit me, I'm accepting visitors for week two. Visitors that bring um, wine. This wine was frozen, but now I thawed it out on my patio. Mm. And I'm accepting, um, what else? Oh, VTech electronic toys for Amos, because he really likes those. So anyway, that's just my rant for tonight. What does that say? Do you have on frost lip gloss? Gina Maxwell, what if I, my lips do kind of look white, weird. No, I don't. Um, I mean, yesterday was evidently some like no makeup day for people that sell Rodan and Fields, which I think is great, but I'm like, I, I don't ever wear makeup. Like I need to have actually a makeup day. And nobody call me and tell me I need to start wearing makeup. Nobody try to get me to start exercising. I don't need to do beach body. Don't make me buy whatever it is because I'm too lazy and I want to eat at subtropic all summer. And I have these good athletic bathing suits that are like very full coverage and old ladyish, but I don't care. Um, so anyway, please come see me. I would love it. Um, I highly recommend this Emerald Point. Not Emerald Point, that's a water park. Emory Conference Center Hotel. I've been so great. I'm have really good fried green tomatoes. Um, we also have some McDonald's. We have popcorn. We have donuts. We have wine from yesterday. And we have 